three. Hi, this is another one of Nick Pad's videos, and uh, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. That would mean the world to me. And uh, this is Foley's Beethoven Lesson One. So now, uh, I'm sorry, I have interference. I'm watching my own YouTube channel on the TV. So um, let's get into part one of Beethoven for the East. Sounds like this. black key right to the left of it we'll play that with the finger number three and repeat that okay so repeat that four times on the fourth time, we just play the E, no D sharp. So uh, let's play that. Two, three, four. And then with our uh, thumb, slash finger number one, if you know the finger numbers, that's right, I'm gonna tell you it now. It's one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, and now once we've done this, we move on to D, it's uh, three notes lower, E, one, two, three, so B, and then uh, two notes higher, let's play D with our middle finger, so I have finger number three, and then uh, with index finger. Slash finger number two, let's play C, it's just one note lower. And then A with the thumb. So A is just two notes lower, lower, and so now it should sound like this combined. Okay, let's look at the, uh, on the right, I mean the left hand. So on the left hand, we've already figured out middle C. Two notes lower is A. So now go to the A below that. The trick to knowing where A is, is there's three black keys. Find where there's three black keys. On the last two, A is in the middle. Play this A. So this is A. And 
then finger number four on B. This will allow it to be much easier for the next part. So... On the left hand, the chord we're playing is E. So E is two black keys. And then I, the note that suggests down from the two black keys. beginning slow so you can see. Go 
five steps higher, so one, two, three, four, five, and it'll reach C, and then go one step down, and then the interval from C, and intervals like this. space to another space on the sheet there's like, like to transform things. So really it should sound like this. And once we play that, we play the same chord as the beginning. So really, right now, it should, all of it should sound like this. to learn how to read music, please leave a comment down below.